Good day, my Achu shakers and movers. How y'all doing out there? I hope you're okay. Listen, I was on my break, just kind of, you know, bringing myself down from my day and, and my clients. And I was sitting in the car and I'm looking at my rear view mirror. And I'm like, why did you put that rear view mirror there? And these side mirrors and I'm like silly is there so you can see what's behind you and then I said but why should I be concerned with what's behind me when I'm moving forward and then I thought of you and I'm like oh my gosh let me share this because if I'm thinking about it then somebody else is thinking about it okay so we know that things are created for purpose right they're created for purpose our job is to uncover what that purpose is and so I am a firm believer that um, if you take the moment and just pay attention to your surroundings, then you'll get answers um, for your life. So you ever heard that saying, you know, stop and smell the roses or stop and smell the flowers? I take that as an interpretation of that. If you smell, if you stop and smell the roses or the flowers, then you'll get this huge insight on things that you've been struggling with for a long time. So let's stop and smell the roses. All right. So you see this? This is what I believe is the rear view mirror, right? See how small that is? But then you see this huge windshield, right? Okay. Everyone has that in their car. At least I think so, right? So I am in this car driving, such as my life. I am driving, I am the driver of my life. And I am going in a um, forward direction because I'm trying to get somewhere, okay? Stay with me. So I need to look through this windshield in order to see where I am going, right? Now, if you notice in the car, you have the rear view mirror, right? And it adjusts it. it. It adjusts itself just a little bit. You can't fully turn it here or turn it there or it break off, right? So the purpose of the rear view mirror is for you to glimpse at what's behind you, right? It's good, huh? All right. So you're supposed to just glimpse as well at uh, um, at what's behind you while focusing on this huge windshield. On what's in front of you they could have made the windshield smaller but that would have kind of restricted your view of going forward right and even the make of the car is so beautiful and if you notice here you have this thing here that serves as a barrier to your um, um, all the way around your blind spot right so we have a blind spot so they created this one right and if it's a smart car, like my car is, is smart, it's smarter than me, it, um, if I can't see out of that for my blind spot, let's just say they give me an extra signal to where my um, this little area will light up to let me know, hey, don't pass right now because what's behind you is too close, right? Oh, man. So if while we're stopping and smelling the flowers, so to speak, this vehicle, the vehicle that you're in, stop for a moment and look at the makeup of it. It is a reason that your windshield is large and in charge so that you're not distracted with anything else and you have a clear vision of what's in front of you so that you can move forward. And the rear view mirror is small and its adjustments is restricted so that you can adjust it right just in the center of what's behind you so that you can get a glimpse every now and then. So why is it important to just glimpse at your past? Why is that important to glimpse at your past? It's important because if you take this rear view that's meant to look at what's behind you, and put it in front of you, you are going to be distracted on what you need to be doing and how you need to get there and moving forward. In fact, you won't move at all because you can't see the next step. All you can see is what's behind you if you make it your windshield. So 
what I'm telling you guys, whew, this kind of took me. This probably ain't new to you, but it was new to me. Is when you are triggered, right? And you find yourself staring at what appears to be a windshield of your past. Stop. Remind yourself, hey, 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 hey. That past view is not supposed to be in front of me. It's supposed to be positioned in such a way that I can't even fully adjust it to get all of my past. I have to adjust it just enough to get the things that's running up on me. Mm, that's it. That's it. You cannot adjust this mirror and turn it all the way to the left or all the way to the left or to the right. It's only designed to get the things that's in the center of what's behind you that's coming up on you. That is it. And then the side is there for if you can't possibly see what's sneaking up on you, just take a glimpse to your right, a glimpse to your left to see what's coming so you know how to maneuver. I hope this makes sense to y'all because it makes sense to me. And I am going to use this as a as 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 a uh, a tool to continue to navigate my life of moving forward guys let me just tell you let me encourage you do not allow a glimpse of your past to take position in front of you it is not designed to do that and your past is not even designed for you to go all the way through and through to the right to the left up and down it is only to get what's coming up on you, to acknowledge the thing that's triggering you from your past. We acknowledge it. We look up at it. Oh, okay. I see you. Oh, oh okay. You you, you want to remind me of the trauma that I went through. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm going to feel that. Okay. I got it. Now I need to look at the windshield because I got to move forward. You're the driver. Don't, let, don't allow emotions to drive your car. You are the driver. Do not allow the past to reposition themselves in front of you. Nah, B, you supposed to be right where you at and I'm supposed to just glimpse. I'm just going to acknowledge when I'm triggered. And then I got the side mirrors to let me know what's coming up on the side of me so I can navigate appropriately. I hope this helped y'all. I hope this encouraged y'all. This is a bit long, but it was good to me. Now I got to get ready to go back to work. Hey, I love y'all. Y'all know what we do on this side of town. We stay free.